Coates, Smithfield, North Carolina. Michael Mumford, Birmingham, Alabama, Roll Tide. Jamal Wilson, Auburn, New York. I'm um, Sheldon Oliver. I'm from Frederick, Maryland. Uh, Chris Galligan from Oshkosh, Wisconsin. Uh, Hayes Poole from Columbus, Ohio. Uh, Doug Strawn from Idaho, Oklahoma. Marlon Jones from Birmingham, Alabama, but I stay in Columbia, Maryland. Michael Ortiz from Chesterfield, Virginia. Hey, I'm Stedman Nash from Pauley's Island, South Carolina. Jamar Robinson from Anderson, Indiana. I looked at two or three different training programs that are offered throughout the United States and uh, based on the description and turned out to be correct, Detail King had the most uh, about the business aspects. Um, I definitely needed some uh, help on the detail and the physical detailing aspects, but we spent an entire day work talking about business and how to get your business set up, some of the legal issues with setting up a business, and um, just kind of how to manage the business. And that, that was really, really helpful. I'm glad I came. I desperately needed the information. Uh, this training is what I needed. I've you know, seen Detail King a long time ago on YouTube, and it's just something I always wanted to attend, so signed up. I think it was a great opportunity for me personally, especially for my business, so that way I could learn and understand in great detail what um, I need to do to be successful moving forward and uh, just to be a better, not only detail, but a, a, a better business person. I've never washed or vacuumed a car in my life. Um, Want to start a new business, a different career path, so the bet, I did a lot of research online. Probably spent three weeks, like one of the other gentlemen said, uh, a lot of research on the different classes and I even had my old man look at it, and this was the one to come to. Um, I used to do detail since I got my license as just like a hobby, and to be able to have a, an actual certification in my back pocket is going to be beneficial going forward when I start my own business. Uh, better myself in the business that I have and learn new tricks. Uh, to learn more about the business aspect. To learn more about the business side of things. I wanted to uh, perfect my craft, enhance my skills a little bit. I decided to come to this class. I've been putting it off for a couple of years. I've been in business for six years, and I need to, to perfect my, you know, my trade. I, I really enjoyed it. it uh, I got I know a little bit about you know running a business, but um, as far as running a detail business, there's some things that are very specific to that industry that uh, was was very helpful. Things I'd not thought about, things that'll probably save me some money and definitely make me more successful. Thought it was perfect, wonderful. Would do again. I loved it. Very informative. Not only was it informative, but it was very like personal. Um, everyone here was very approachable, very knowledgeable about what this company represents and how to detail. And for me, that was very, very big because it's what I needed. The business class, uh, I definitely learned a lot of stuff with the niches that you can get into. Uh, a lot of things I never would have thought about um, if I wouldn't have came to it. Uh, I thought it was fantastic. There's a lot more information than I was even thinking there was going to be having all those niches and markets as to where to benefit yourself was fantastic. Uh, just really hone in some of the skills that I already had and learn a lot more than I already knew. Uh, a lot of information, uh, be able to bring it back and use a lot of it. I think the business club was helpful. Much needed information, uh, learn about my profit margin, uh, marketing, uh, just doing business on a level. I thought it was very informative, uh, especially the marketing piece, because you have a proven leader here in Detail King that uh, show that is willing to show you and teach you how to uh, market your own business. The business class was good. I mean, I've, I've already been in business for about five years, but I came here and it taught me different avenues to explore and uh, different ways to attract more clients and clientele. It's amazing. I, you know. I jumped in the game, you know, on my own. I didn't have no structure as far as getting the business started, so I came here for, you know, a better structure. It was very good. We, uh, the groups were small enough where 
you had uh, time to do your own thing and, and if you had questions, there were plenty of instructors around, um, plenty of equipment, supplies, so uh, you never felt like you were bothering an instructor to ask a question. They were all really willing to help and, and plenty, of, uh, plenty of vehicles to work on, so it was good. It was amazing. Well, it was very detailed. You know, they went through everything with us. You know, the, the tricks and techniques to different things. I loved it. It was great. The hands-on class was um, very detail-oriented. Uh, every step was broken down to its finest form. So I just felt that the knowledge that we gained here, you know, uh, taking this, this class was, was something that was uh, needed that we could put in our arsenal as well. Well, I've, since I've never done detailing, I've been very nervous about the whole process. Uh, wet sanding, compounding, the whole kit and caboodle made me really nervous. But after the first day, that all went away and then I was nervous about the interior. But they definitely explain it to you on, on what to do and break it down in the best way possible. Big fan. Um, I loved how the trainers were a first rule would be they explained everything in detail first before you actually did it yourself. So when you knew what you were doing, you could actually do it correctly. I was extremely impressed with it and it really, I mean, the first day here boosted my confidence more than I've ever had more confidence, never. Uh, really enjoyed it, learned a lot of new stuff. I think the hands-on training was awesome. Uh, they teach you every step uh, of how to be a professional detailer. Uh, to be a professional detailer, you need to do a great, uh, I'm sorry, man, a great job on detailing and to get the information that they gave was awesome. I thought it was very informative. Um, all the instructors were willing to answer any questions you had. You were able to get your hands on a lot of various equipment that you may not have in your arsenal at the time. Perfect, we, we, learned, uh, we learned a whole lot interior and exterior. The hands-on training, anybody that's in the business needs to you know, have this. You save a lot of time and money, and you make a lot of money. Oh yeah, definitely. Any, uh, uh, hopefully if the business grows, hopefully any employees uh, that I end up having will definitely be coming to the class. And uh, anybody that's even considering opening uh, or starting a detail business, for sure. Absolutely, a lot of people. Yes, everyone. You know, if I'm blessed, if I'm, if I'm you ain't even got me finished, man! <laughs> got me finished, I was on the road! If I'm, if I'm blessed enough, you know, my business grows, you know, everyone who wants to work for me will have to come here. For sure, and just like all the other guys said before, anybody that will work for me in the future will definitely have to come through a uh, Detail King uh, training session. I'm already planning on referring my son. Uh, yeah, I would. Um, anybody who likes cars or into the car scene or anything, um, it's always beneficial to learn how to do it yourself and take care of your own ride before you touch anybody else's. Absolutely. Definitely. Absolutely. I'll uh, send some friends, and future employees. Absolutely, any um, new people looking to get into the business, I would definitely refer them here, and even um, detailers that already have their own business, because I feel like they can learn something as well. You know, definitely, if you haven't came, came to this class yet, you ain't doing nothing but washing cars. Yes, I would. I had my son lined up to go. He would have came with me, but he got to get his stuff together, you know. <laughs>